Heaven or hell? Heaven or hell? Choose this day whom you will serve. Hell is not a sinner's paradise. Hell is not a big party. There's going to be no casinos in hell. Your greed is condemning you. The love of money is the root of all evil. Repent from your fornication. Repent of your pot smoking. Repent of your drunkenness. Liars will not enter the kingdom of heaven. Thieves will not enter the kingdom of heaven. Repent or perish. God is commanding all men and women everywhere to repent. Turn from your evil ways and turn to the living God. Let the wicked forsake his way and the unrighteous man his thoughts. Time is short. Judgment day is approaching. Life is but a vapor. Death is sure. Make peace with God before it's too late. The wrath of God abides upon the children of disobedience. Jesus Christ is your only hope. Jesus Christ is the only answer. Jesus Christ came to save from sin. Amen, Jesus Christ came to save from hell. Jesus Christ died on the cross for hoochies. Jesus Christ died on the cross for drunkards. Jesus Christ died on the cross for the greedy. But it's time for you to repent. Time for you to stop taking God's grace as a license to sin. The unrighteous will not enter the kingdom of God. Neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor homosexuals, nor thieves, nor the greedy, nor liars, nor extortioners will enter the kingdom of God. Seek the Lord while he may be found. Time is ticking. What happens in Vegas, God knows. What happens in Vegas, God will judge. Oh, God's going to put an end to this wicked, evil city. God is going to put an end to Sin City one day. The great and dreadful day of the Lord is at hand. Repent for the kingdom of God is near. Repent for Jesus Christ is coming back soon. Repent. That's the one word God wants you to receive today. Repent and believe. Riches profit not on the day of judgment. Your silver and gold will not save you on the day of judgment. Save yourself from this wicked and adulterous generation. Flee from the wrath of God. Run to the cross. Run to Jesus. He's your only hope. He's the only answer, heaven or hell. Heaven or hell. Choose this day whom you will serve. God isn't willing that any should perish, but that all men may come to repentance. Only the fool says in his heart, that there is no God. There will be no atheist on the day of judgment. Eternity is one breath away. Death is one breath away. Oh, 10 out of 10 people die. 
You're going to die and meet God on the day of judgment. Are you prepared to meet your maker? Are you prepared to stand before your creator? The day is coming when God will judge the world in righteousness. Outside of Jesus, your sins will condemn you. Time for you to take hold of the gift of God. Time for you to open your heart to the Word of God. Open up your Bible. Know the God of the Bible. Obey the God of the Bible. Fear the God of the Bible. Submit to the God of the Bible. Honor the God of the Bible. Stop disrespecting God. Stop offending God. Stop ignoring God. Stop displeasing God. God will judge you. The eyes of the Lord range throughout the land, beholding the good and the evil. Nothing is hidden before the eyes of God. God searches the heart. God knows the intentions of man. You're going to be naked and exposed on the day of judgment. Repent unless, unless you repent, you will all likewise perish. For what does it profit a man to gain the whole world but lose his very soul? Light has come into the world, but men love darkness rather than light because their deeds are evil. Your problem is that you love darkness. You love evil. You love sin. You love what God hates. Oh, and you hate what God loves. The Bible says, woe to you if you call good evil and evil good. If you take sweet for bitter and bitter for sweet. Turn to the Lord. Seek His face. Jesus Christ, the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. Your only hope, the only answer, the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the Alpha and the Omega. There is freedom in Jesus. Jesus can set you free from your drunkenness. Jesus can set you free from your conceitedness. Jesus can set you free from your greed. Jesus can set you free from your lust. Jesus can set you free from your pride. Time to be set free in the name of Jesus before it is too late. Time is ticking. Fornicators will not enter the kingdom of heaven. Drunkards will not enter the kingdom of heaven. Blasphemers will not enter the kingdom of heaven. How much longer will you continue your sin? How much longer will you continue sinning against the Lord Jesus Christ? Sin kills. Sin kills. This generation. Walk faster, walk faster. This Jesus Christ. This generation desperately needs the truth. And the Bible says that Jesus is the truth. If crank it up all the way, Jesus, crank it up all the way. You don't have the truth. If you don't know Jesus, you don't know the truth. Repent today, tonight. Abandon your sin. Believe the gospel of Jesus Christ. Repent from your sins. Hell is real. Angels are real. God is real. 
She who made the eyes is watching you. She who made the ears is listening to you. Today is the day of repentance. Tomorrow might be too late. Stop sinning against God. Stop making God angry with your sin. Stop rejecting the Lord Jesus Christ. Stop your sin. You cannot be saved if you don't repent from your sin. God is calling you to repent and make terms of peace with the Lord. Let's all serve the Lord Jesus Christ. Let's all serve God. It is a beautiful thing to serve the Lord. It is beautiful to obey the Lord. But it is horrible for them that live in sin. It is a horrible thing to live in sin and die in sin. He who made the eyes is watching you. He who made the ears is listening to you. Wake up, arise from the dead in the light of Jesus is shine upon you. Sin is not for the wise. Sin is not for smart people. Sin is not for intelligent people. Drunkards will not inherit the kingdom of heaven, the kingdom of God. Fornicators will not inherit the kingdom of God. Repent tonight. Repent before you die. For it is appointed unto men once to die and after this the judgment. We will all give an account for the way we're living our lives. And God is angry with the wicked every day. And the wrath of God abides upon the children of disobedience. If your name is not found in the book of life, it will be horrible for you. It will be horrible for you if your name is not written in the book of life. Tomorrow might be today. Yesterday has passed. Today is the day to repent. Let's make terms of peace with Jesus Christ. Let's get right with the Lord. We have sinned against the Lord and we need to go back to the cross. We have sinned against our Creator and we need to make terms of peace with Him. Let's go back to the cross. Let's go back to the Lord. He's waiting for you to repent. He's waiting for you to go back to the cross. Stop living in confusion. Do not live in confusion no more. There is absolute truth. And the absolute truth is Jesus Christ, the Son of God. Let's go back to the truth. Let's go back to Jesus Christ. Jesus came to save that that has been lost. Jesus came to save, to give life, to restore. Jesus came to show us the way. And the way you're living your life is not the way of righteousness. The way you're living your life is not the way for eternal life. Don't give your life to drunkenness. Don't give your life to fornication. Don't give your life to the devil. Repent today. Today is the day of salvation for you. Stop working for the devil, the devil doesn't take good. Repent for your sin. Your sins are killing you. Your sins are leading you to hellfire. Your sins are killing you to hellfire. Tomorrow might be too late. You don't know if you're going to make it to tomorrow. Today is the day to repent on your sins. God is angry with you, sinner. You need to repent today. God is not playing games with you. Last right here. <laughs> repent from your sins. The judgment is at the door. Get right with Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God. Jesus is the way, the light, the truth. Yes. You cannot be saved without Jesus. You cannot be saved unless you repent and believe the gospel of Jesus Christ. You're not saved in your disobedience. You're not saved when you're living in sin. 
You're not saved when you come to this village to sin. Jesus came to seek and to save the lost. Jesus came to call sinners to repentance. Jesus came to destroy the works of the devil. Jesus came to die for the sins of the world so that you can be forgiven. But you must repent. You must be born again. You must forsake your sin. You must submit to God. You must humble yourself before God. Time is ticking. Time is short. Heaven or hell when you die. It's appointed unto man to die once and then comes the judgment. We shall all appear before the judgment seat of Christ to give an account to what was done in the body, whether it be good or whether it be bad. Everything done in the darkness will be brought to the light. God will judge the evildoer. God will judge the drunkard. God will judge the homosexual. God will judge the pothead. The greedy will not inherit the kingdom of heaven. The love of money is the root of all evil. You're a lover of pleasure. You're a lover of money. You're a lover of self rather than being a lover of God. Time to love God with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength. Time is short. The wrath of God is being unveiled against all ungodliness and wickedness. Judgment Day is approaching. Judgment Day is coming. Jesus Christ is coming back in flaming fire to judge all the ungodly and all the wicked and all those who disobey the gospel. Jesus Christ is coming back from heaven to earth and every eye will see him. Jesus Christ is coming back in glory. Jesus Christ is coming back to judge the living and the dead. Jesus Christ is coming back to separate the righteous from the wicked. Jesus Christ is coming back to put an end to evil. Jesus Christ is coming back to put an end to Las Vegas. Sin City. Sin City. Nothing but sin in Sin City. What happens in Vegas, God will judge. What happens in Vegas, God knows. Fornicators will not inherit the kingdom of heaven. God hates divorce. God hates a proud look. God hates hands that shed innocent blood. God is angry with the wicked every day. The wicked shall be turned into hell and all the nations that forget God. Hellfire awaits the sinner. The kingdom of God awaits the righteous. Are you righteous today? Or are you living a sinful life today? Without holiness, no man shall see the Lord. It's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living God. Eternity awaits. Eternity is a long, long time. <laughs>